back at the four by eight, four foot by eight foot. My wood's falling apart. I had pulled this from another spot where we had a, a four by eight garden. So anyway, I, d I didn't expect this to last another year or so, but who knows, it might. But uh, I brought out some more coffee grounds and tea bags and banana peels, eggshells. But as you can see, I've already put a layer of newspaper in there. And what I did was I, I had put all kinds of little, like dirt from other pots that I had, some dirt that I'd grown in a worm bin I'd put in there. Lots of banana peels, coffee grounds, tea bags, eggshells. And I've got some cardboard here that I'm going to be layering on it also. So we, we got a lot of rain lately over the past three days, so I haven't really been out here much. Uh, but the newspaper held up really well. Uh, I guess it'd take time for it to break down. But uh, that container right there uh, was filled full of water, so I went ahead and poured that in here too, just to kind of get it wet. But uh, I just take my time and I, I layer stuff, like newspapers, cardboards. So there's a little bit of cardboard on the edge there. And, uh, you know, I put plants, like there's some stems from some plants that I had. But I've got, uh, you know, like dead parts of the plants that were in pots and things that we were growing, like tomato plants and, you know, different herbs and things like that. And I got all those underneath the newspaper. But anyway, I just take my, uh, and this will help hold down the newspapers too. You know, as I uh, put things in here and they slowly, you know, add up it'll hold the newspaper down sometimes you know i guess raccoons or something may come around and grab a banana peel or something but got some old tomatoes in there too but a couple of old bananas there yeah these two got got pretty mushy old mushy ones yuck yuck and that one went bad but just Anything that will decompose, right? Anything that you've already consumed and, you know, like coffee grounds and banana peels, and you know, every bit of that is good for your, your gardens. And the reason I say it's good for the garden is, is because, well, it decomposes. It turns into dirt again, eventually. Um, like tomatoes. Man, you bust that open, it's got a thousand little seeds in it. So it may end up with some tomato seeds growing out here. Anyway, I just threw it down and it busted. So, just put all kinds of odds and ends in there. And uh, it adds up. And you layer it and, it and it decomposes and the worms come in and turn it into worm dirt. And, uh, you know, it's just, it's just good stuff. And you'll be amazed at how quickly all of this will add up. I mean, if you come out here, say, three times a week and do this, it adds up and becomes a good, nice layer of, of of stuff that you've put in your gardens and uh, i found out that earthworms love coffee grounds you know they like their caffeine fix just just as much as we do so tea bags you just throw them in there but my house i think we're all addicted to coffee so we've all you know got our coffee grounds and we just you know I try to get everybody to save them, but they don't always. You know, I'll do my best to get them to pitch in and help me do my compost. But that's all there is to it. You just 
layer of your newspapers and cardboard and oh mosquitoes got me and uh eventually i'm gonna i'm gonna get that container that i was doing my vermicomposting in i'm gonna bring all that out here and dump it in here and that, that should give me you know a good layer of good dirt maybe uh maybe some worms to sit in there over the winter time too but anyway Whenever I come back out and do the cardboard around this, I'll, I'll make a video of that and show you that too. And uh, well, for now, give me some thumbs up, subscribe, uh, come back and watch my videos. Um, I do all kinds of videos, uh, nothing specific, just random stuff. But anyway, I, uh, I gotta get back in the house and help clean up in the kitchen. See if I can find anything else to bring out. I know it looks gross, but eventually it turns into a really good spot for plants. And uh, talk to you later. Give me a thumbs up. Thanks.